or you begin to have that uh, that gut feeling, right? That's what um, you know. That's what that means, right? That's what acknowledging your intuition and not ignoring it. When you see that red flag, or you see you think some, or you're going into a situation. It may be a business deal that you're feeling funny about, right? And you just like it's just something about it, right? You just got this red flag in your mind, and you just don't think it's all the way right but you ignore it and you do it anyway and you end up losing money and you set yourself back financially two three years right it it happens because you fail to acknowledge your intuition right um and for women for women primarily um women are built with intuition which makes them um Oh man, which oh man, it makes them a a uh, a beast when it comes to reading men and uh, you know making these uh, you know making the best decision when it comes down to a lot of things because they the women who are in tune and they acknowledge their intuition are are definitely someone that you want in your corner because they can let you know uh, if there's trouble up ahead before you even see it right. Uh, and that's what I'm talking about. Understanding that you are accepting the fact that you are a being inside this body who has the ability, um, you know, to, to foreshadow things or to, to foresee things before they actually happen uh, or, or hear things that other people don't hear um, or feel things that other people don't feel. Right. That's called your intuition. You're not crazy or or schizophrenic or. You know, because you hear that inner voice, which is you talking to yourself, right? You know, they think you're crazy because, you know, oh, well, he's talking to himself. That's because you're talking to yourself inside your inside your mind, inside your inside you. That's what's happening, right? So if you don't believe me, stop for a minute and say without moving your mouth, right? Without doing anything, say to yourself. I am an infinite being, right? Just take a minute and say it. All right? So who said that? Right? So you, you said, I am an infinite being, and you did not move your mouth, right? So you said it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Who said that? Like, you, you spoke, but you didn't move your mouth. You see what I'm saying? It, it's that's how that's how deep these things go, right? And there's layers and layers to that. But uh, you know, always acknowledge that gut feeling. Always look out for the red flags. Um, you know, these things are a part of what of who and what you are, right? And that is an infinite being that has inhabited a body, inhabited a body uh, to explore life in the physical form okay that's what you are and that is very important so please um keep that in mind uh continue to become the strongest version of yourself um and please it is nothing wrong with you wanting to know yourself uh, there's nothing strange about you um you know because you want to be a stronger version of yourself okay so continue to pursue your goals guys um Please, um, you know, think twice before you make that uh, irreversible decision. All right. There's uh, there's other alternatives out here. There's this platform. There's other platforms that you can take advantage of. And, um, you know, suicide is not the only alternative. It's not the only way. Um, you know, there are people out here that care about you and love you, um, you know, without wanting anything from you. OK, guys, listen, y'all take it easy, man. Live life to the fullest. Try not to do too much. Peace.